everyone and welcome back so as you've seen in my last video i've done a little like a little tiny haul on revolution products and i'm going to be reviewing those today and it's going to be like a face impressions i do i i'm not going to put eyelashes on because i'm having a very normal day to day um and i don't have an eyebrow pencil so i won't be using eyebrow pencil and i won't be using revolution mascara i will however be using the foundation concealer i'll be using emmyway powder because i also purchased that i'll be using the revolution pro eyeshadow palette the revolution ultra blondes the revolution highlighter drops and the highlighter and i will also be trying out the what's it called again studio london lip kit and and i'll be setting it all in place with this little boy so if you want to see what the outlook of my look will look like oh my god and i'm so unhappy about this little friend here look i hate when i get spots on my face i think it just ruins the entire look so if you want to see what i come up with then just just stay tuned and i'll see you in a minute so anyways like i was saying i'm gonna start off with the eyes obviously so i'm going to take the conceal and define in the shade z2 i don't know if you can come any closer i don't know oh whoa 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 whoa, whoa that's far too close get closer that'll do oh my god this is so close so like i said i'm going to take the shade conceal and define if i can get it open because my hands are so we see because of I use why do I do this? Why don't I just apply it with a brush like normal people? Right, so anyway, I'm getting it open. So I'm just gonna place it on my eye. Da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, that looks like a better shade. I'm gonna take my concealer brush. Create a base on the eyeshadow, don't get rid of any discoloration. Create a blank canvas. And by the way, I just used the um the El Polis Polis. How do you say it? Polis Polis Polis. The Elf Polis primer. That's all I use for all over because I have huge pores. We all know I've got large pores, so yeah. So the first thing that pops into my mind when I look at that palette, when I look at the Revolution Pro palette, it's like I get rainbow vibes from it. So I'm going to take my A38 diffuse crease brush and I'm going to go into the colour attached. It's a very soft beige colour. I'm just going to stick that above my crease just very lightly just to create like a base behind the colours I'm going to put on. I'm not sure what colour yet to put on. I'm really really not sure. There's also like a really bright white in here as well. It's all matte as well so yeah, so once I've created that base, which is looking nice, looking nice, I'm going to be brave and just do you know what is I'm going to go in with this colour, ring leader, and then maybe do the outer corner with this underdog. Hell yeah. And obviously, I'm hope, not hoping for the best, obviously, because with them being all mattes. But we're just going to try. Wow. I'm just going to pack that all over my head. Wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is pigmented away. You know what is revolution? Oops. Yet to disappoint me. Why spend like a lot of money when you can get affordable products? I mean, there was a bit of fallout, but I probably went a bit overboard with 
access that I'm actually packing on. So it's gonna go for really well. It's not simple, but it, well, it's a simple look, but it's a like a catch your eye look. And then what I'm gonna do is take a wide, big, fluffy brush, and then go in with underdog, and then pop that in the corner, then up over to deepen the crease up. don't worry about any fallout or anything obviously it's gonna be looking mighty fine I'm gonna put on a bass on do you know what it is I was gonna start singing there that really wouldn't have been a good idea no 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 so let's blend everything together and that that is popping that is popping. So I'm just gonna go off the off the camera, do my other eye, do my brows, then I'll be right back. See you in a bit. Right, I'm back, do my brows, do my other eye. Um so what I like to do is I like to do my base and then I like to go on my mascara. My foot is so dead, I'm really sorry. So with this, I'm presuming that oh my god, that feels so nice. Okay, maybe it might be a bit too dark. We'll wait with it. So I'm presuming you just paint it on. Oh my god, that's so creamy. Just paint it on. Just paint, you know, like you're drawing a picture. Yeah, just paint it on. That is so bloody creamy. That is the... Oh, that's so nice. That's so nice. Right. Poop is in the pudding. Now let's blend, 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 blend. Yeah, that is part of dog. Never mind. We've all done mistakes. That one I'm proud of. Let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look. I mean, I wouldn't say it's applying nicely. I probably have put way too much on that's probably first like what was that oh that's where I've messed a bit got a massive crease and of course leave my eyes out because I'll be going in with a concealer make sure it's all blended in and not Yeah, I'm not sure. And it another good thing, it doesn't dry down really quick. Like most of my foundation sticks, which is a mega plus. So actually, do you know what it is? It's blended out really nicely. It's looking dewy. Looking nice so far. I mean, you can still see the bump where my spot is, but and I'm really sorry if you can hear me partner and the kids in the background. They're not very quiet. <laughs> so then next, I'm gonna go on to concealer. Just do with the norm under my eyes. Just little dude up, mouth, chin, nose, and I like to spread it out a bit. I mean, imagine if you're having a really crappy day and you forgot to blend this all in, you just that will be my look. And this blends lovely as well, yeah. How are you? And that isn't too bad. It's a nice brightener. Because like for some reason, when I bought like the Fit Me one, the Maybelline Fit Me and stuff, I bought like pretty much the same shade at the time. And I'd just come back off holiday, so it's like really tanned. So yeah, that's 
that's looking really nice. I can't believe how nice that is actually looking. Looking good. Looking good. Right, now I'm going to quickly set everything in place with this MUA powder. And of course, it's got a sticky thing on it. Why wouldn't it? Christ. So I'm just going to use my sponge to, if I can find it, I don't know where the hell it's gone. My leg is so dead right now, I can't feel it. Brush. Not brush. Sponge, where you gone? Sponge. Sponge. I'm not even joking. I don't even know where the hell it's gone. I'll be right back. Sorry, during that little break, I stuck some earrings in. Me sponge was right the way across the room, which... Right, so I'm going to just sort this creasing out. There's minimal, and I mean minimal creasing. Pardon me. So, let's see what you're made of. And I've got really dry skin, so... I literally leave it on for a few seconds and then I wipe it off because yeah dry upon powder upon dry skin is like a big fat no no but I really push it in so I don't get no creasing at all and then what I do is with the remainder just use a little it's a um it's a contour brush but hmm, just take the rest and just swirl it all over and where my pores are I really push it into my pores like really so it's set so it doesn't sink into my pores if that makes any sense so it gives us like flawless base yeah you'd probably hear me little boy screaming it to be fair that um around my nose as well because i'm a nose person that fill with my nose quite a lot which is probably no by the first my first few channels where i'm like that and like that and like that and it's just nerves i mean come on i'm completely starting to chill out as well at the minute like do you know that is a really good match like i mean what my neck is very white but look So I'm really quite pleased with that. I mean, considering like, if I'd done this, or if I'd done that, it's like, no, 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 Emma. Right. So now that we've got the base all looking, looking as best as I can, I'm stick my lid back on there before I forget, and it goes everywhere. So thumbs up to that so far. I'll let you know how it gets on my next video. I'll give you like an update. Um, what's, what's next? Oh, I'll be two seconds. I'm just going to do my mascara and then I'll come back and we'll do the bottom part. Two seconds. Right, hello, I'm back. Um, the mascara I've been absolutely loving at the minute is, are you ready? Drum roll. These are going to be very surprised. It's no bougie or no drugstore. It is actually George. Cool, cool, cool. Now we all know I have the worst eyelashes in the world. They're short, they're straight, they're just crap. But that actually looks like I've got eyelashes in my head, in my eyes. So I'm going to take the colour Ringleader and just smudge it along the bottom. son is very tired and it's really really tired there we go but what i'm going to actually do is because this palette has no highlighter in it i'm going to take this from the i heart makeup naked chocolate palette i'm going to just take a small um like it's a detail brush i think yeah detail brush 
and just stick that in me in a corner and brighten it up a bit and my brow bone just give my eyes a little pop 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 look at that beautiful I was gonna do a um, video of how I used to do my makeup like in high school I don't know how I even got through the day I just I think to myself oh my bloody lord right so eyes are done there's my son crying again it's really tired I'm really I just I'm really sorry about that um so now onto the fun stuff I'm going to bronze first now I'm not sure what sort of colour this is because obviously it's me first impressions I don't know if I'm going to need loads but by the looks of it no I won't what's going on I mean who loves me cat yes Matalan 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 that is all I've got to say about that very nice it's not too grey not too orange and it doesn't look dirty as well which I'm loving because it's not worse than a dirty bronzer Um, I'm not going to contour the day contour today Um, but I am going to try this out Right, I'm really scared about this. This is like this is literally the first time ever I've used liquid highlighter, and I'm so scared, excited but scared. So I'm li I'm not even gonna squeeze it. I'm just gonna literally, like, just dab it, and I don't know whether I just tap it in. <gasps> oh my god, that's so bloody nice! Wow. Like I haven't even, I've literally just took the excess product off. I have, I have, I haven't squeezed it. I've just literally like just tapped it on like that. With my ring finger of course. Wow, that is absolutely beautiful. Right. Now I'm going to get carried away. It's a very nice consistency as well. I'm going to be cloning the gods today. Just push that all in. I put too much on. I know I have. I already know. I know. I already know. And it gives a nice. Like a nice sheen to the skin as well. Look at that. Oh, I am glowing. Just blend it out a bit. Blend that, blend, and it blends out really nice. I tell you what, give it a sponge. I should be using my sponge for this, maybe. Sorry, just blend that in. Oh, yes! Oh, yes! I know why people like that now. I know now for the pierce de resistance, the highlight power holder, and it, it is in the shade champagne kit. Oh, look at those cheekbones! Oh, also, I don't have a blush as well, so I'm gonna have to use. I stick my brush. You know what? See what this can do. Oh, shite! I'm not even gonna like. <sighs> it's so freaking pretty. I'm just using like that. I haven't like I haven't dipped my brush in it anymore. Like that is freaking popping. That like that is glowing. I'm just going to look at myself in the mirror all day and go. Sorry. I'm a right weirdo. I'm a right weirdo. And if this is your first time watching it, I'm really sorry. I'm not normally this weird. So. I'm really liking the highlight. Do you know what it is? I really haven't got anything bad to say about anything. Like, at all. I'm just taking me, um... I can get it open, which I never can. You sig my brush. Not me sig my brush. You sig my blush in the shade Nymphia. And how do I get my cheeks again? I 
just tap that on and just blend it all together. Imagine if I look like that. I just still like this. Would you still watch us if I look like that? Let us know in the comments down below. <laughs> just kidding. Right. So, last but not least, let's see how this bad boy opened everything else for this. Well, at least just know it's a first impression because I'm just opening it. So, and this isn't the shade. What shade did I get again? I'm sure it was nude or something like that. It doesn't say on the thingy. Sure, it's nude. Yeah, I'm positive it's nude. Because it says in the box it's nude. Now, this is a lip pencil. Let's see. Yeah, I'm just on Go, 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 go. Now, the litty. <gasps> right, I'm confused. It's a liquid lipstick. Oh, actually, I don't think I got the matte. That's why. That's why I'm confused. In it, the colour match is like that is lush. Now to set this off would look lush with a pet of with a pet with a pair of falsies, but I don't have any. Well, I do have some. I just don't have some like right here right now. So this is a finished look. I don't know how to do all this model -y stuff, but this is a finished look. And I don't know which is my good side and which is my bad side, but this is a finished look. Please like if you like the video. If you didn't like the video, give it a thumbs down. It's completely for you. If you want to see more of me, please subscribe. And until next time, boys and girls, I shall see you later.